everybody. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. Today I am going to share something with you, something that I've been going through lately and I wasn't really sure whether I was going to make a video about this or not, but I decided to make a video because it was very, very hard for me to share this with my family and friends. And in case anyone else out there is going through this, I just wanted to talk to you for a minute and encourage you to open up. So I have a very stressful job. My job is really, really stressful, but some other things have made my job more stressful over the last several months and extraordinarily stressful over the last month. And I have been experiencing a lot of anxiety, um, some panic attacks, and just feeling like the stress was completely overwhelming and I didn't know what to do about it. I didn't really know there was anything I could do about it until I really started looking into it. My first big problem was that I was trying to hide it from my family and especially my husband. I didn't wanna let him down. I didn't want him to feel disappointed in me for some reason because I was experiencing stress that was so out of control that I just couldn't figure out what to do to fix it. And when I finally opened up to my husband and started sharing with him how I was feeling, right away he said, you know, we need to get a handle on this. We're going to the doctor. So I went and I just met with my primary care physician and I explained to her what was going on. I explained to her what I was feeling when I got there. I had really high blood pressure. So she knew that something was going on with me out of the ordinary anyway. But as soon as I started talking to her, she immediately said she needed to give me some time off of work so that I could get into some counseling and figure out what's going on and figure out how to help me get healthy again. I had gotten to where I had lost weight. I wasn't eating like I normally am. Um, I was losing sleep some nights, overtired other days, and I just couldn't figure out how to manage my sleep properly because all I could think about was work and the stress of my work and my issues that I was having at my job. So. I have now gone and had my first appointment with a therapist. Meeting with the doctor was so helpful just because she let me know that I don't have to go through this alone, that there are a lot of options and a lot of things out there that can actually help. And that's what I want to share with you because I had no idea that all of this was available. Really, my con biggest concern was that I was going to show up and the only thing that the doctor was going to want to do is put me on medication. And that was not the case at all. There are counselors that you can meet with. There are groups that you can meet with. I am starting to meet with a counselor. I'm also gonna start a work group that I will participate in. And I think that all of these things are going to be so helpful in helping me recover, helping me become my best, my best me. And I just really wanted to share this with you. You know, one of the number one things that the doctor told me is she asked me, where is your happy place? What is the play, you know, where can you go to find peace, to find happiness? And of course I told her Disneyland. So instead of prescribing me medication, she told me that I need to get to Disneyland and any places that provide me with security, peace and happiness as often as possible during this time off so that I can come back to my happy self. My husband has said that over the last at least few weeks, but also the last couple of months, he has noticed a change in me. I'm just not my carefree happy self. He knew there was something going on, but he didn't know what it was, and he didn't want to bother me about something if it was just him feeling like maybe there was something going on and there really wasn't. And now that I've opened up to him finally, he completely understands and I just wish I would have done it sooner. I wish I would have opened up to him right away when this started happening so that he could help me work through it, so that he could help me find some solutions and so that he could get me to Disneyland more often to help bring my joy back. So if you've noticed a change in me in the videos at all, I try really hard anytime I'm on camera to put on a smile and bring out some excitement for you no matter what. But if you have noticed any kind of change lately, 
that's what it is. And I just decided, you know, I try to share things with you guys that I think might help somebody. If anybody is watching this video and it helps them decide to get help for themselves, open up to someone, go get into therapy, it's surprising, but it is really helping me. And I've only been to one doctor's appointment and one therapy session so far, and it is helping me immensely. I'm learning some great coping skills. I'm just learning so much already, and I'm looking forward to learning even more as I continue on this journey. I'll continue to share with you my progress and let you know how I'm doing. I now know I'm gonna get through this and I'm gonna be okay and it's just gonna bring back my happiness again because it has been so far lost and the stress just creeps back in and continues to just take over. Stay away from that job. And stay away from that job. So I am gonna be off work for a while. I'm gonna try to get back into some of the things that I love so much, like crafting. Obviously, we're gonna be taking some trips to Disneyland and trying to do some really fun things just to take my mind off of things, like the doctor said. She also told me to try some meditation, which I've been doing every day, get out and walk every day, which I have absolutely been doing, but to try to just absorb as much fun as I possibly can. So. That's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to try to bring out some great excitement for you as I'm going through the healing process at all of our fun, happy, peaceful places and journeys that we take. I hope that my sharing this with you has helped. Um, if you or anyone you know is experiencing this, make sure to encourage them to open up to their friends and family. You know, your loved ones are there for a reason. They're put in your life for a reason so that they can help you through these times. And go see your doctor. You don't have to do what they tell you to do if you decide you don't want to, but it's worth at least going, figuring out what they have to say and seeing if they have something that's helpful because it has really, really helped me so much. I hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!